And a third rider who uh, trains with Papa, with his dad, who is also, of course, a professional dressage rider and trainer. Um, we saw um, Laurens, of course, on the Dutch team with uh, X against all rights a couple of years ago. Many Dutch riders came down to Videbon also last week for the CDIO. A solid trot tour, really clear, clear movements and trot. Nice halt and rain back. Again, another horse who knows Grand Prix, intelligent one, really anticipating on the PF. And now uh, we've got the loss of impulsion here in the PF. Um, but going out in the passage was fine. Passage is regular. Took a few steps for the horse to relax in the extended walk. Not the easiest uh, work in the walk. But of course the riders know how to handle. And again, just a loss of uh, impulsion coming into PF. And it is going quite a bit forwards. That was really the opposite from uh, Valentina starting uh, the changes much later. We're really uh, straight, straight changes and uh, really steady from the start. Every single change was uh, really of good quality. And another really nice uh, extended canter. Easy going. And again, really straight changes. Uh, this horse says, I think it's really a strong point, really straight. Uh, it's not the craziest uh, expression and not huge changes, but it's uh, really from from one part to the other, really 
steady and straight and really small pirouette nice preparation oh and just a uh, one stride too much and then uh, Laurence had to go back to the center line that's always the tricky part it's a bit like on the roundabout you have to know when to stop to be back on the initial point it's really a clear clear round and uh, really from one point to the other really precise and the transitions are really nicely written so it's not the biggest mover um, but it's just a solid ride uh, we always have those uh, problems getting into PF uh, it always takes a, a few strides for the horse to just settle into PF It's one of the very few tests without uh, mistakes. Bravo. Merci, alors.